We know that banking is based on the fundamental concept of trust, and any erosion in that can and does lead to outcomes that even weeks earlier would seem unlikely or even unthinkable. But we saw that play out recently, didn't we? With the uh, collapse of Silicon Valley Bank and the forced sale of Credit Suisse to UBS, depositors here in the United States freaked out. They freaked out so much so that they moved not a small amount, but a lot of money from small local banks to bigger, too big to fail banks, to the tune of $120 billion in the week ended March the 15th. All of this news is pressing on an economy that is already threatened with so many other challenges right now. Layoffs all over the place, inflation that's going through the roof, an economy that personal savings has diminished uh, to some of the lowest levels we've seen in forever. And let me ask you a question. How is this feeling to you? How is the news that you hear day in and day out in recent weeks affecting you? How is your portfolio? Are you retired? Are you hoping to retire? Are you hoping to stay retired? If you have questions about your portfolio or things that you have set up and you want to know how these recent situations may impact now or in the future, get a second opinion. We always say, if what you thought to be true turned out not to be, when would you want to know it? If you're doing everything right, getting a second opinion and having someone tell you you are spot on, it all looks great, wouldn't that be a good thing to know? But if you're not, wouldn't that also be a good thing to know?